Hey guys, Chris of Chris Training Code. I'm back. So apologies for the long hiatus. Uh, life gets in the way. But I'm back and I have a slightly new focus for the stream. So we're still going to do the same thing we've been doing where um, you know, we check out the beginner stuff and also just in Eastern code, you guys can, you know, hop on to, you know, see some bigger projects being done or, um, you know, just hang out the chat. But one of the things I've been doing while I've been gone is hanging out on the um, Learn JavaScript channel on Reddit. And I've realized that one kind of, one of the biggest challenges to becoming a programmer and also kind of ironically, one of the things that's least talked about and covered is how do you actually go about like designing a program? So, you know, it's one thing to, you know, learn the basics, learn the syntax and stuff. That's kind of like learning to, you know, read and write. And then there is so tons of tutorials for that out there. We'll still cover that stuff some, but, you know, there's lots of other resources for that out there. Cause that's, kind of the, the easy part to teach. Um, and then you have the other side, you have endless numbers of tutorials, a tutorial for how to do it, build a to-do list, you know, how to build a calculator, blah, blah, blah. Tons and tons of tutorials out there. The problem is that there's a gap in between learning the syntax, learning how to read and write, and then doing a tutorial, which is building an app, but they're basically holding your hand and telling you how to build the app. And you don't really have to think about building up. There's a great big chunk in the middle of how do you figure out how to build the app? And it seems like that's probably the area where you see the most people not only, you know, struggling with that, but they get frustrated and give up because it's like, okay, well, I can, you know, I know in this statement is, I know variables are, blah, 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 but I don't know how to actually create programs. So that's what I want to start covering. So what we're going to do is We'll basically, you know, it'll still be kind of like what we're doing before we'll pick a project, but instead of just me being like, hey, here's, you know, we're going to do this, 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 and this, we're going to actually work through how did I come up with this, 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 and this, you know, so instead of just teach, instead of just showing you what we're coding, we're going to talk about how to figure out how to figure out what to code. Um, so hopefully that'll help you guys out if you're wanting to learn. Um, you know, I know it's a real struggle. And it's one of those things too that it's, you know, it's syntax and stuff. It's kind of like, you know, a math equation. You can just be taught a math equation and then you know the math equation. Syntax is kind of the same. Once you know syntax, you know syntax. But learning how to create a program isn't quite like that. You know, it's more like uh, learning to play a sport or play music. You know, it's not really something you can be taught the rules of a sport or you can be taught, you know, here's the C key and the D key on the piano. But it takes practice to actually be able to play that sport well or to be able to play music well. Programming is a lot like that. To be able to properly and easily be like, okay, here's a project I want to build and break it down. It takes practice. So that's what we're going to do, lots of different projects. And we'll break it down and that way we can actually practice, you know, Here's a prompt. How do I turn this prompt into code? How do I figure out what parts I need to build in order to turn that prompt into code? Because I think that's probably one of the hardest things, and that's a very soft skill too. You know, it's not the same as you know an if statement or you know algebra or something. You you really have to kind of practice it, and there's no like one way to go about it, and there's no one right answer. So that's what we're going to do. So um, today we're going to start with the calculator. Um, reason for doing a calculator is, you know, every, we're just going to do a simple calculator. Everyone's used the calculator before. So it'll be easy to conceptualize. Um, and, you know, we'll do various other pro projects and stuff. If you guys have ideas for, you know, small projects, something we can do in, you know, six hours or less, maybe a couple hours ideally, um, you know, shoot, shoot them to me. Um, you can hit me up on Discord or you can hit me up here, or uh, you can leave a comment on YouTube. So uh, all the links for that are all on the, the channel page. Um, and yeah, so let's go ahead and dive in with the calculator. 